I, I feel really terrible when my father calls me and he has to uh, have, it, have his drug refill and he has to pay at the hospital. I think any system that takes the health care, the life of its people seriously should have, should have a, a, a set of funding that is dedicated to the care of the elderly. The elderly in our society, we don't care for them. Imagine a pensioner who's retired for over over 25 years ago, and now his mega um, um, retirement salary he gets every month. He has to take care of his head from that. It's a very bad thing. Go to developed country. There's fund allocated for funding the health care for for the aged aged people in the society. You shouldn't pay from your pocket. Those things are cushioned by government, but here we don't have that. Buhari himself, I mean, he's an elderly, he's a, he's an elderly person or aged person, but he's in government right now, he's able to fool this, those people for himself. But he will be out of government for, uh, sometime, but is it what he wants to do with what he's being paid as salaries or, or, or retirement uh, remuneration? It's, it, it's not the right thing. In most countries where you place value on people, they don't even, the veterans don't even join the queue. They have, a, they have an easy access to go and see a doctor. Nobody restricts them, and the government pays for it. Why is our own a different ball game? One thing I pray that the average Nigerian will understand is that what goes around comes around. If you are young now and you think that the old person can get to places, one day you become old, and the same fate will befall you. So we must start now trying to understand that what we do to others is what we do to ourselves. And it's better for us to do good to others at all times.